Welcome everyone. How are we all doing today? This is Skelly by Nature. I am Skelly and I thank you all for joining me in this video today. And this video I'm doing, uh, again, a couple people reached out to me with the recent events that have been going on involving cough medicine. There's been multiple recalls with cough medicine. There's been many cough medicines that have been removed from shelves because they find they have, they don't work. They simply don't work. It, it, it's been a gimmick. I, I, and so I had a few people who have reached out to me and asked me if I have something or what I use. Uh, and as many of you know, I, one, am very uh, attentive about pre being preactive. So I'm one that I like to keep my immune system boosted and I do have a video on, on the things that I do to keep myself from getting sick, first of all. So I will include that video down below for you to, to watch because the best medicine is to not be getting sick. And so this one here, uh, a couple friends of mine, they, 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 the whole family got sick, the, the adults, the kids, everyone. So they're asking what I would do uh, for, for a natural cough medicine. Uh, so this is something that I've come up with and I'm going to be making for them and so I'm going to share my recipe with you guys and I hope you guys enjoy it and I'm going to get set up in front of the stove and we'll go from here okay so what we need for this mix for this cough medicine is I'm going with I've got a cup and a half of local honey the reason we're using honey uh, is for it, it helps with soothing your your sore throat and I'm also going with a uh, I'm gonna be you're gonna want to have either one to five fresh lemons or if you want you can go with a lemon juice like I'm doing that's this is a juice you know concentrated when we use the lemon we, you know, we're, we're using it to boost our immune system. The vitamin C and the minerals and the vitamins and everything really helps beat that cold. And so when you do make this, one of the things that you're going to want to do is try to use as much lemon as you can. We're going to add some lemon to this. If you can bear some more lemon, then add some more. The more lemon you have, the better off this, this mixture will uh, help you. And the other thing that I also have is I have a half a cup of olive oil. You can use regular olive oil. What I'm using today is I actually have an infused olive oil. I infused it with whorehound. Uh, I use whorehound because whorehound's great for breaking up mucus in our body and our in our throats and everything else like that. So. It, helps break that mucus up so we can get it up and out of our system. And the other thing I did is I also infused it with mint. And mint, like anything else, you see it in a lot of our cough medicines and cough drops. And the reason is, is because mint boosts the immune system. It helps fight anti uh, toxins in our system and helps us obviously beat our colds. The other thing we're gonna need is two jars or a jar or two um, I'm making this for two people, so I get two jars. If you're making it for your family, all you really need is one. And then we're going to need a spoon to do some stirring. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to take a small, a medium to a small pot, and we're going to turn that on to a, a, I like to start at a low, medium. And what we're going to do is... I'm, so for, for those who are interested in doing the infused oil, I do also have a video on that. I will include that video down below in the description. So if you're interested in using, doing that, um, I'll, I'll add that video for you. So our first step is going to be adding that honey. So now I'm going to go and add in my oil. And I'm going to pop in, I'm going to squirt in some. I 
Okay, so now that we have all the ingredients in, we're just going to give it a good stir. And basically what we're doing is we're just looking to heat this up and get this mixed up. Okay, so now my honey has been kind of melted down a little bit. It's not as thick as it normally would be. I've got the oil and the and the lemon juice in there. And we're we're at a point now that we're probably at, you know, 100, 120 degrees. Uh, I'm just before it's really going to start to boil, which I don't want it to really boil. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn my stove down. I'm, I'm at kind of a, you know, kind of low, but I'm on two uh, on my stove. I'm going to let this sit for about 10 minutes and I'm just going to keep stirring this for 10 minutes or so and try to get this to kind of fuse together a little bit. And then once I do that, I'm going to be able to pull this off and we're going to let this cool down a little bit. So I, I will be back in about 10 minutes. Okay, so it's been roughly 10 minutes now. And I am ready. I just shut my burner off. I'm going to pull this off to the side. We're going to give this a little bit, a little bit of time to cool down before I go pouring it in. Okay, so now we're ready to pour this into our jars. I should be cooled down enough. Now, when you go to use this, one thing that I do suggest is um, you're going to want to heat this up. And basically what you're going to do is you're going to want to use a teaspoon for a child and a tablespoon for an adult. You're going to want to keep this in your fridge. And like I said, one of the best things to do is take it warm because the warmth actually also aids and helps soothing your, your sore throat. So there we go. Okay, so there we go. We got our two bottles. Uh, and like I said, keep it in your fridge. Teaspoon for a kid, tablespoon for an adult. It's best if you heat it up a little bit first. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you learned a little bit today. I hope you guys go ahead and make this and try it. And if you do, feel free, drop me a comment down below. Let me know what you think of it. Uh, tell me, you know, if there's anything that you guys think should be added or, or anything else like that. Or if you got your own idea, let me know. So until the next video, be beautiful. Be awesome.